developing tonight and a major departure from his predecessors. Pope Francis signaling that he supports same sex civil unions. It is a move that is stirring up controversy and confusion, but also giving some Catholics hope. CBS 46's Bobeth Yates has details. Well, to some, it seems like the church is making a complete 180, but Pope Francis's words is giving a lot of people hope. This is my partner of, uh, of over 20 years. This is Peter awesome. Ambarato is one of many in a same-sex relationship who is excited about the recent comments by Pope Francis. I had 17 years of Catholic education, grade school, high school, and college and then uh, was married and divorced to a woman. The entire time, Ambarato says he knew he was gay, but the church did not accept him. I struggled many, many years trying to fit into a mold that was not me. So Pope Francis is uh, opening up the portals for a lot of tolerance for many, many Catholics who have felt as I have. In a documentary film, Pope Francis said, Homosexuals have a right to be part of the family. They're children of God. What we need to do is create civil union laws. That way, they're legally covered. The comments sent shockwaves throughout the LGBT community. Religion has been the biggest oppressor of um, LGBTQ people. Having a leader like the Pope speak out about people who are in same-sex relationships is a huge step. Um, Rebecca Staple Wax is with the nonprofit Sojourn. The organization was created to promote change and inclusion for the LGBT community throughout Metro Atlanta. And she adds the Pope's comments helps with that inclusion. As for Ambarato, he says the Pope's words give him hope. We're not a threat to traditional marriage. Nobody wants that. All they want to do is be accepted. In addition, those I spoke to say this is the first step in a long process of getting the church's acceptance. Bobeth Yates, CBS 46 News.